spent a good part of the summer of 2016 in the far north of Scotland. I slept the car and passed my days either walking or boating. Exploring Loch Laxford and going round the remote island of Handa was one of the highlights of the summer. I parked beside the old boat house in the early evening, had some dinner, then watched the sunset. During the night I heard a large stag wandering around the car. Once it realised there was no food and that I was not a threat that went on its way. Looking forward to my day at sea, I was up at 5am and on the water before the sun rose behind the hills. The forecast was for light winds during the morning, with the weather front arriving late afternoon bringing moderate seas. Leaving the shelter of Loch Blacksford, a rolling swell started to bob the boat's bow. The constantly moving water gave the illusion that the sea was breathing as I made my way south towards the island of Handa. Handa is an island nature reserve and home to over 200,000 seabirds. I confess to feeling very alone and vulnerable below the 300 foot cliffs in a very small 9 foot boat. The adrenaline rush keeps me going and I also enjoy watching the birds in their natural environment.
having successfully navigated the exposed west coast of Handa, I decided to land for breakfast. I found a stunning sandy beach and scoffed a sandwich while soaking in the sea views. I'm not a fan of stone balancing, but found this one quite artistic. Refreshed, I continued on my way. I watched a flock of foamers flapping around a rocky reef before heading up the sheltered sound of Handa. I navigated the northern reefs to return to the sea, looking over my shoulder for a last look at Handa. And then the island was gone. I had to pinch myself to make sure I had not been dreaming. It was an early start after all. It was still too early to go back, so I headed for Loch Dugiel to the north of Loch Laxford. <laughs> Having done all I wanted to do in Loch du Gael, I took a shortcut back into Loch Laxford. The winds dropped completely as I stopped for a spot of fishing. I hoped the gulls in the water had better luck than I, because I caught nothing. All too soon it was time to head back, another perfect day in the water over. Thank you.